the cherry on top of today was I had no idea where this lady lived. And I went around the moon to get to the sun. But guess who the sun was? Well, the sun, I knew the sun. I know the sun, he knows me. Shocking. She lives there. You know, you've got your, your White House in every suburb. Well, that's where I dropped her off at the White House of Johannesburg North. And you know, <laughs> I never knew that. But it's very important. So it was my cherry on top. Thank you very much. We are getting a visitor next year from Germany. Wie geht's? Ja. And the name is Sasha. Sasha. Sasha is the youngest son of a wonderful man that used to live here in South Africa. And he came and stayed here for a month in August 2018, I think it was. Shame. Sasha lost his mother. I think he was four years old. Four or five. He has an older brother. They lived in Weltefrieden Park, just up the road. They went sailing. Uh, what's the word is? Boogie, no, it's like Hobie Cat. I don't know if you know what a Hobie Cat is. It's like, it's a multi hull It's a, it's a catamaran it's like 12 foot long 15 foot long and there's two holes and a trampoline in the middle and so she had a lifeline so she was connected to the catamaran but it went turtle it turned turtle as they say in sailing and turned upside down in the middle of the lake, it's called Hartepeersport. And uh, they did get to her, the paramedics did get to her, but they didn't, I don't think they had adrenaline to inject her. It's just, you know, in a disaster like that, everything can go wrong. And she died. She was gone two young men. Sasha works in a sausage factory in Germany. And so it brings us back to, because, you know, it's a pretty depressing week. Actually, according to Google, the 16th of December, internationally wide, is recorded to be the most depressing day on the planet. <laughs> I don't know if you know, but I've made many videos about the 16th of December in South Africa because in the past we celebrated as white people the Battle of Blood River. How terrible is that name? They killed so many black Zulus, or black, they killed, killed so many Zulus, like a hundred thousand, no, ten thousand, that the, the river ran red with blood because these Zulus had never experienced anything like a bullet before. There were only like 400 and something, less than 500. Afrikaner Boers. 
And it was always hailed as a, a win. Yeah. They killed all these savages. And today we pay. I pay. The whole world pays for that, actually. And so I gave to a lady. She's my age. Maybe she was born two weeks after me. She works at the store, the supermarket up the road. She cooks the food, the takeaway foods, you know, you know, it's in, it's, it's our national food. You can't say indigenous because that's what I live off as well. <laughs> I've Millie pup. That's why I stay healthy and thin. She's a little bit overweight. I think she also has diabetes like me. You know, then you get your sugar rushes, your sugar lows, when you sweat. But she asked me, and I'm so glad she asked, because then I asked. You know, once you ask, then you start this chain. With the right people, at the right time. Where would I get young, small, not young, but small, women's clothes from ha 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 but I got them and to my wonderful client who she comes every Saturday every Sunday for a treatment from me because and it's no funny business it's a treatment it's my treatment that I formulated and she pays for weeks in advance, and she's younger than me. And she had some excess clothes in a box. And so I could impress this woman, my age. She's a grandmother now. She has a daughter and a granddaughter. And she lives like me in a room like this, but she has a granddaughter and a grand and, and, and a daughter. I don't. And that's why, you know, I make these videos. And it made my day. Only you who's watching this, who cares? And me. I'm blowing my trumpet. Yes. For you. To show you. Not to show off. It's not ego. I said to her, next year I will give you a, a voucher. You know, my livelihood, my life ended because people thought that it was important. <coughs> the whole world changed. <coughs> <coughs> Nothing will ever be the same. But my love and these people of Africa's love will never change either. And it's stronger than ever. And yes, it would be great to submit and run away go to Europe, Germany, America, but it would be so much greater if I could assist in making people's suffering that much easier. Yeah, when I was born. I'm sure you would understand if you were born here. Not other people that were born here. No, 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 no. They, you know, chasing that, that next best thing, the better golden taps to open 
so the water that comes out that comes from my cistern of my toilet it gets re revitalized at the water plant at the fertilizer plant do you know that urine is actually a very good fertilizer anyway before this gets too long it was a good day and thank you Mr. Pitoka. one of these days T rinse is going to appear because my hair needs a rinse <laughs> And yes, there's a song. I wonder if you checked out on my page, on my community page. There's Frank Duval. Please go and listen to that music. It was my impression of mine almost 20 something years. Yes, we have so much to talk about, and maybe I should go live. Maybe, Sippy, Sippy, maybe we organize a time we go live together. Have you seen that yet? And you and I go live, and we go against Team Rose, yeah, <laughs> like Benny Keys. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, join the Lionel train to the YouTube streets. You got first class with me because there's light at the end of the tunnel. It's the future. And you choose it. You choose it. It's a Tuesday. No, it's Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Ciao for now. Totsis. Salani And this is Tiga saying, Come, Tiga. Come, 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 come. <laughs> Ding 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 ding. The smoke is different. The closer you are to it, but because of the candle. You don't see what I see. Whatever one eight eight three oh seven oh two. At this hour, I'm going to be speaking to Stanley Beckett. We're going to be talking about what are the practical things that you can do to deal with the state of burnout at this point. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Looking forward to this oh. conversation with Stanley Beckett. Oh, yes, baby. Of course, Senator, I mean, Zuma has been saying that there's also precedent. It really gets affected. It's amazing, yeah. Oh, it's like fireworks.